Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is Whoopi speaking. I wanted to show you some experience I've made with Gary Stanley motor. So I have made some special coils. This is double coils, as you can see here. The upper coil is only on clockwise, and the down coil is counterclockwise. Then I made another experience with the number two. It is clockwise up and clockwise down. In fact, there is no difference because you can flip simply the wiring and you get the, the same effect. You can do it in parallel or in series, but it depends, everything, as Gary said, of the uh, poles of your rotor. It is very important to have the right poles. But now I have made another test with a single coil, as you can see here. It is a single coil, no double coils. And I put it here, it is two of this one, made in series, alright? This is a whole effect sensor, and go on my circuit here. It is all circuit I've made for OC motor as the, before. And I wanted to show if it is some lost as a normal motor, if it is an attraction motor, as uh, Peter Lindemann said before. So I will put now the power on the motor. Okay, so I put the leads. I have to hold. Okay, and goes. Goes very fast indeed. No problem, it is 11 volts. Okay. And you can see 0 0.6 milli. Uh, the 60 milliamps. I will break now. I break, I break. Goes up, but very slowly. You see, 0 0.8, 0 0.9. It is almost stopped. I let it go up. I think it is really nothing to do with the conventional motor. Just a single of the oscillator on the scope. I have to stop the motor because it goes so fast. Okay. I hope this helps. Good night.